This question asks us to solve an equation involving sec squared theta, which is 1 over cos squared, and a tan theta. Now, there are some golden rules to be aware of to allow us to solve an equation of this type. Now, the fundamental rule is that sine squared theta plus cos squared theta is always 1. However, if I divide each term in this expression by cos squared theta, I can derive another equation. Now sine over cos is tan, so sine squared over cos squared is tan squared theta. Now cos squared over cos squared is 1. 1 over cos is sec, so 1 over cos squared is sec squared theta. So, I therefore know that sec squared theta is tan squared theta plus 1. So back to the equation here. I can replace sec squared by tan squared plus 1. So this becomes 2 lots of. I'll let tan squared equal t squared, just for the moment t squared plus 1, and that must equal 5 lots of t. So again, I've let tan theta equal t just for the moment. If I expand this, I get 2t squared plus 2 equals 5t. If I now take away 5t, 2t squared, take 5t, plus 2 equals 0. This then factorises to 2t and t. I need a minus 2 and a minus 1. 2 times minus 2 is minus 4. Take away t is minus 5t. Therefore, either tan theta, because t was tan theta, equals 2, or tan theta equals 1 over 2. Now then, to solve these I need some range of values for theta. I'm going to state that theta is between naught and pi. So I want the values of theta between naught and pi. The question must specify this. So to find theta, I just do inverse tan of 2 and inverse tan of a half. Make sure we're in region mode. Shift tan of 2. That gives me 1.107. And inverse tan of a half gives me 0 0.464. I can find more solutions by adding pi or subtracting pi, but that would take us beyond the given range for theta. So they are the two solutions for this equation in the given range for theta.